Hi everyone, thank you so much for such an amazing response to all the videos that you're showing. I've come back again with yet another amazing video in which we'll be discussing six major opportunities that have come up. So some of these opportunities are for hiring, some of these opportunities are just challenges, some of these opportunities like uh, have certain cash prizes, other opportunities, some of them are intern roles, some of them are full-time roles. So these are for all the batches for like if we talk about batches of 2021 to 2023 and like uh, some of them are for a 2020 batch and previous batches as well. So we'll discuss about these opportunities. But before that, if you haven't already subscribed and liked this video, do like and subscribe this channel so that uh, you can get to know more and more opportunities in future. And we have uh, made a very good playlist in which we are discussing about how you can grab these off-campus opportunities, like if these companies are not visiting your college, right? So in this video, let me start with the first company that I have uh, here for you. So the first company that I'll be talking about today is EXL Services. So EXL Services, like they generally conduct this challenge like they conducted it last year also so this year also they have come up with this amazing challenge for people of pre-final year so if you are in 2022 batch uh, then this challenge is particularly for you so it is known as eq uh, 2021 so in this challenge like they have rolled out certain business case studies certain other case studies and you need to submit those uh, solutions to those case studies uh, as soon as possible so i will give the complete details at the end of this video regarding how you can apply for the same and like other details so this is basically going to be a very good opportunity in which there are some PPI as well as PPO opportunities with EXL services, right? So the next opportunity that I'm talking about today is uh, Dell. So Dell is basically having its two challenges. So like, uh, like JP Morgan Chase conducts a challenge known as Code for Good, right? Through which it hires people. But Dell has also come up with something of a similar kind of thing known as Tech for Good in which they are asking you to develop some, uh, give some uh, good ideas related to uh, sustainable development goals, sustainability, like how you can present your ideas in a better way. They are asking for some video, uh, uh, video related to that topic or some presentation if you can submit. So I'll uh, also discuss about this opportunity and it's open to all, right? They haven't mentioned about any hiring through this, but uh, they have mentioned some exciting opportunities await you if you are like uh, selected for this challenge. So uh, might be, it can be hiring, but they haven't mentioned it clearly. Next, when we talk about the third opportunity that Dell have come up with this, uh, Dell, uh, Code Diva Hackathon. So this hackathon is basically a women specific hackathon that 8th March is coming. That is the International Women's Day and a lot of other opportunities might come. So we'll discuss about all the opportunities that will be coming for women as well. So if you like uh, want to know more and more about these opportunities, you can uh, subscribe to this channel. But uh, the third opportunity that I was talking about is uh, International Women's Day. So this is basically for women of batches 2020 and before. So if you are from 2020 batch or before, then this opportunity is for you and you should be a female candidate so they have roles available for software engineers for product managers for product analysts for full stack developers so along with all these roles so you can apply for these opportunities at dell and uh, this is basically a female hackathon the next opportunity that i'll be talking about today is publicist sapient so publicist sapient has come up with a uh, uh, hiring drive for 2020 batch that is for junior technology associate role and they are offering a package of close to 5 lpm and uh, this is basically for those people who have lost their jobs or who haven't been able to get a placement due to 2020. So you can apply for Publicist Sapient Junior Technology Associate role. When you talk about the company, so overall uh, brand value and the company's work culture, work life is good for Publicist Sapient. The next opportunity that I'm talking about is basically in Sony Research Development Center. So Sony Research Development Center is looking out for interns for a period of around 1.5 to 2 months. So this is basically a role that uh, is specific for those who are interested in data science, those who have some hands-on experience in Python, in uh, related technologies. Along with that, uh, they are not asking for you to have certain experience, but you should be familiar with uh, the, these certain technologies like machine learning and Python. So this is also going to be a very great opportunity as Sony is a very good brand. So do apply for this opportunity like if you are uh, currently in your school or currently in your college, like uh, if you are from batches 2021, 2022, 2023, so all are eligible to apply. You just need to be in your college, right? Or you can be an undergraduate. So the next opportunity that I'm talking about is by Optum. Optum is basically uh, a company like it's uh, also has its branch known as United Health Group that is UHT. So it is hiring for the batch of like they have, haven't mentioned specifically any batch but they have rolled out a software engineer role at Hyderabad. So this is basically a role going to be like the eligibility for this is undergraduate. So if you feel that you are suitable for this particular uh, job role, so do apply for the software engineering role at Optum. So Optum offers a package of close to 13 LPM. So if you are uh, suitable for this role, do go and apply. 
Now let us look at uh, how you can apply for these opportunities and I'll give you a brief glimpse about uh, their websites and what are some of the important details while application. First challenge that I'm going to talk about is uh, EXL Analytics. So EXL is basically EXL is a services company and it has launched this challenge EXL EQ 2021. It's basically for the batches of pre-final year that is 2022 batch. And uh, like you can get to know more about the details like they have opened their uh, case study round already on 8th February and case validation and date release will be on 24th. Registration is going to close at 28th Feb. So 28th Feb is the last date for registration if you haven't already and you are interested to register for this. So go ahead and register for this. Before 428 and eligibility is basically you can see third year students enrolled in BTEC program, fourth year students enrolled in MTech or MSc, first year students enrolled in MSc program of Delhi University, and first year students enrolled in MSc and statistics program of IIT. So you need to participate it in, in a team of two. So if you haven't already like applied for it, go ahead and apply. So you can see uh, the national winners will be getting prizes worth rupees two lakhs, and the national runner-up will be getting prizes worth rupees one lakh. PPO and PPA opportunities for the finalists. So there are like a lot of campuses that are eligible for this particular opportunity. So if you are from these participating campuses, go ahead and apply for EXL Analytics uh, competition. The next competition that we are talking about is that Dell Futurist Tech for Good. So this is basically. Uh, a type of uh, challenge in which you need to submit all the details and uh, you need to share your idea in the form of video word doc or powerpoint like in which uh, format you are comfortable with and you need to mention all the details with uh, that you need to uh, share it in a google drive link so you can record your video and upload it in google drive and then you can uh, submit the link here so this is like they haven't mentioned any hiring for this but they have written that uh, exciting opportunities await so you can uh, just give it a try if you are into this space and you want to be a part of like you want to participate in this dell futurist uh, tech for good challenge the next that we're going to talk about is diversity hackathon by dell technology so this diversity hackathon is basically uh, for hiring in this they will be uh, giving you some uh, roles like job opportunities for uh, women candidates and the eligibility rules for this is like if you're a full stack developer data scientist software developer product designer product manager with one to ten years of experience so people who are from 2020 batch or before they can apply and uh, it is basically for women like you can see the timeline 22 22nd Feb is the last date for application then there will be shortlisting submission and the final hackathon results will be announced by 10th March. So go ahead and apply like they have very good prizes as well as along with that uh, PPO and PPI opportunities with Dell Technologies. The next opportunity that I'm talking about is Publicist Sapiens. So it is hiring off campus for 2020 graduates for the role of junior associate develop, uh, associate technology. So they have asked uh, like all the information related to everything and um, go ahead and apply for this opportunity like if you are looking for some uh, like if you have a package lower than 5 LPA then you can go and apply for this or currently if you are jobless then go and apply for this challenge if you are from 2020 batch right this is like uh, if we talk about the company's brand name and company's reputation so it is good as compared to other companies next we are talking about this uh, interns opportunity with Sony Research so Sony Research is hiring basically for interns for data science, data engineering and web API development roles. So these are open for freshers as well as college students with no prior experience. So freshers as as if as like what we can understand from this is th those who are in college currently in 2021, 2022, 2023 all can apply if you have a good, good ex like uh, if you know how like, like know various things that they have mentioned like the skills that they have mentioned basically in Python, NumPy, Pandas, SQL, Scikit-learn and like Matplotlib, machine learning, JavaScript. So these are some of the things that they are they want you to have like other skills like if you have that would be an added addition so to apply for this opportunity basically you need to uh, message uh, dr uh, angshuman ghosh so he is basically the data science head at sony research india or you can send your cv to rakshit ravi kapoor i'll share their links in the description below so that you can directly get to know and how you can apply for these particular roles the next uh, that we are talking about the software engineer role in uhg that is optum at hyderabad so basically when you talk about this particular role uh, you can go ahead and apply for this like when you talk about the qualifications they have written at it has undergraduate degree or equivalent experience so people um, so this suggests that if you are from uh, if you are undergraduate and if you feel that you have this these skills uh, that have been written like if you are uh, good in java spring boot hibernate web services so you can go ahead and apply for uh, this role at uhg uhg is like it's a world famous healthcare company and uh, the composition that it offers is also very competent. 
so go ahead and apply for these opportunities thank you so much for watching this video and like uh, now you have known of these six opportunities if you feel that you are suitable for any such opportunity go ahead and apply right now because uh, time is running out so don't wait any don't wait for anything just go and apply and for more opportunities and for more experiences for more uh, amazing and amazing content coming ahead go do like share and subscribe this channel and thank you good luck bye bye